Hi, my name is Kelly. I'm a cardiac nurse at Palo Regional Hospital. February is Heart Month, so we've put together a series of videos for heart healthy tips that we'll be sharing with you each week. This week's topic is on exercise. Exercise has many benefits, including working the entire body, increasing muscle strength, preventing heart or other circulatory diseases, improving blood sugars if you are diabetic, as well as helping with sleep and stress management. The American Heart Association recommends 150 minutes of moderately intense aerobic activity each week. How do we put all that together? Whatever works in your schedule is how you're going to build that program into your day. 150 minutes shouldn't be done all in one day, but spread it out through the seven days. We encourage people to exercise nearly every day, even if you're only able to get in 10 or 15 minutes. Uh, the next question people usually have is how hard is moderately intense? We use the talk test. Sometimes I use something called the sing test. The talk test is we ask people to be exercising hard enough that you are able to maintain a good conversation but you could not sing during that conversation. So think about when you're exercising, am I able to talk to the friend I'm exercising with? Am I able to talk out loud? Am I able to sing a song right now? If you're not able to sing a song at all or get all the words out to a song, you're probably exercising too hard. Varying your activities is also very important. Just being a runner and running all the time could lead to overuse injury. So participating in some different activities such as biking, walking, tennis, pickleball, you name it, all of those activities are great ways to get out and start moving. Always remember before starting any exercise program, please consult with your physician. My name is Kelly and this is a Heart and Healthy